Hello guys and welcome to the second episode of the... Have I gotten a name for this campaign? I don't think I've come up with a name for this campaign. It, like some like... Uh, Messalians in the Far East, you know? Because that's what we are. Well, we are not that right now, but that's what we're aiming for. Uh, so in the previous episode we used... Uh, we started out as the Nestorian uh, Count of Urunki. Sadly, we got cancer and we died. But the advantage of dying by cancer is that we, uh, our character next in line, was actually our half brother, who happened to be the Duke of Kauchu, or yeah, Kochu, Kocho. I don't know. I will never be able to pronounce that correctly. Uh, so that happened, and now we are the Duke. Sadly, that means that we are no longer Zoroastrian, and we are instead, or I mean, it means that we're no longer Nestorian, and we are instead a Zoroastrian, which is of course no good. Uh, we do have a plan, though, for uh, ensuring that our future children will be Nestorians. Now, we're going to do that by educating our grandchildren by Nestorian, peop Nestorian people. And we're going to try and make sure that the Nestorians stick around by breeding them. So, I guess we'll go into the f character finding. We're going to search court. We're going to find the, the various uh, Nestorians that are hanging out here. So, this is my friend, and this is my friend. Wow, there's only two of them? What? Did, did one of them die? I swear there was three before. Regardless, um, did I... No, I thought I t told this guy to marry in the previous episode. I guess I didn't. He arrived at my court. Okay. Yeah, no, I'm just confused now. Well, let's let the game tick a bit. Do you have a wife now? Ah, there we are. That's that's what I want to see. There we are. Now, uh, he has a wife. So hopefully he'll breed and he'll gain glorious, glorious Nestorian children. So that if he dies, there will at least be another generation of Nestorians to take up where he left off. And hopefully educate our children so that we can become Nestorian. I'm going to do the same for this guy. Uh, I'm going to make sure he becomes, or you know, breeds as well. Lustful. Yeah, she's a bit fat, but that's okay. Ah, eh, not that bad, actually. So, yep, off you go. Marry, marry. Now you will uh, now you will have children. Also, let us uh, disband our levy. Let's go to Holy War. I want to fuck up this guy. Actually, could we fuck up this guy? Are you... Yeah, no, you're Zoroastrian. Well, we can probably Holy War him next generation, though, because then we will be Buddhist. Because our heir is Buddhist. This guy, though, he has no friends. So I think we can... Uh, well, not necessarily safely invade him, but... Who knows? Probably... I really don't know if actually if we would be capable of defeating these guys. But regardless, uh, I, I don't know. We, we'll just have to try. So let us go Holy War for Khotan. Onwards, then. Let's raise that levy back up. Old levy. Damn it, I hate that when you zoom, zoom out too much. It stops selecting the troops and it starts selecting the counselors for some reason. Yeah, let's run up here for now. Have anybody joined? Not yet. Let's hope that that does not change. Yeah, we're also over our domain limit because, you know, reasons. I don't want to lose all my domain on succession because we do have multiple children. So there's going to be quite a lot of gavel kind mess. Which is uh, going to be quite nasty, but oh well. Well, off to war then. Well, that really wasn't... I mean, if nobody's going to join, we might as well declare multiple wars and fuck, we're losing a lot of money. Aye, aye. Yeah, that's not good at all. Um, let's see, could we assault this or somehow use our mercenaries? Like, I need to use these mercenaries before they are no longer available to me. Uh, army... I don't, I don't care about the commanders. I want the human band in a separate army. You know what? What I'm actually going to do is I'm going to take my levy. I'm going to have them run home again. And I'm going to see if I can start another war. Oh, fuck, that is going... Oh, man, that wealth is going away quickly. All right, so disband those guys. Let's see if we can get a Holy War going for this guy. What? We can only do one of them at the time? That's very lame. Fine. Let's do... I mean, he owns both of them. All right, let's do this. We'll do... Kotan. Right? Yeah, Kotan, this one. 
province called? Yeah, the province is even called Kotan. Sure. Off we go. Now we have another war. Raise the levies again. I guess send this guy to see if we can he can kill himself off so I don't have to pay as much money anymore. And hopefully leave him so weak that we can use our levy to defeat him. That would be optimal. Oh fuck, he did gain people to join. He did uh, make people join him. That is a big potential problem. The battle of... Oh fuck me. Oh hello. Raiders. Well, it's not like we can do anything about that right now. As long as nobody's currently under threat from him. I guess we'll be okay. Who's this army? Another daughter. Gunes. Sure. Oh fuck, we just went bankrupt. Can you guys stick around a little bit longer? Yeah, it seems like they can. Oh god. We might have fucked up big time. More children? Yeah, yeah, yeah. More bastards. Okay. <sighs> Acknowledge. Okay, get rid of the mercenaries. Okay, now we're in trouble. Because uh, now we might have overstepped ourselves a bit. Might have just gone a bit crazy and started a little bit too many wars. Uh, we are gaining money again though. Although the fact that we're in a deficit... Yeah, the moral of your armies will suffer. That is not good. Can I take loans actually? I don't think I can. I can! Very well. Fuck, that means that meant I could have actually kept those mercenaries. Well, oh well. At least now we can um, make sure that the... Ooh, well, though, you're weak for some reason. Let's go kill him. Yeah, he has shit morale. Go, go, go! Are you at war or something? No. Oh, fuck. Now he is not that weak anymore. Run then, I guess? Oh wow, this is a problem. Yeah, no, that's that's bad. And we have a disease. Yep, we have consumption. And we're running into it. Brilliant. It's not in our capital though, so I don't think we're gonna close the gates just yet. Come on, defeat him. If he can, oh man, if we can defeat him before the other army comes... <gasps> we fucking did! Holy shit, the AI is so dumb. Hold your ground, man. We just outwitted these guys. We just outwitted them big time. Oh, yes. More children! Jesus fucking Christ. This is going crazy. And why are there dangerous factions? Who are you? You claim that that's a dangerous faction? It's just one dude. Damn it. Can I take your land? No. He's rebellious. Well, we'll fuck him up later. Uh, right now, we, we're we not going to do that. So yeah, we got another daughter. Jesus Christ, we're breeding fast. We have one wife. And we're still just going mental. We don't even have any, we don't even have any concubines. I guess we're sleeping a bit around, but still, this is crazy. So, yeah. This is so far good. We're actually a friend of our own kid. Yeah, more daughters. I'm not going to bother giving them fancy names. I really need to come up with a, like a standard name for daughters. I haven't done that yet though. Oh fuck, we have consumption in our province. Shut the gates. Some commoners have already gathered outside as your guards are starting are start closing the gates as a sighted thump silences the curious chatter coming from outside the castle. Or coming from the other side. Still. Seal it. So I mean aren't we out in the field though leading armies? So it's not like we're actually hiding inside of our own castle, right? <laughs> actually no, we're not leading the army good or something I don't know keep chasing them down uh, we need to push press our advantage Ooh, achievement wasn't easy enough achievement I guess uh, there's an army that I would like to kill off okay so he now died yeah we just need to continue pushing here kill all that we can see before they're able to reinforce each other go on now get in there oh god this might have been a very bad idea Ooh, oh, oh yes! It is a glorious day. This guy is our prisoner now. He's an architect. Maybe he can build some houses or something? I don't know. Yeah, so we got some prisoners, and this guy is... I mean, I don't even know who he's fighting. Okay, where are you guys going? You're going to Kashgar. Alright, follow them. I mean, we could... Actually, let's siege... I, I, I think we have sufficiently fucked him up at this point to where we can reasonably safely start sieging down the capital here. I know, they're sieging down our shit. 
They're burning it, I know, I know, I know. But it's not like we can do anything about that. So yeah, this army is actually going to get killed off, hilariously enough. No, it's not. It did live annoyingly. You're actually going to attack me. Yeah, he is. Oh, well, you can try. Bitch. Come on and siege. Lately, Duchess Blue has been showing symptoms of illness. She might have contracted the plague, but of course, nothing is certain yet. She can stay in the dungeon! I think she can though, can't she? She's coughing. She's gonna cough at stuff. She has to go. Ah, okay, so we can just expel her. Yeah, that, that makes sense. Go away. <laughs> An honest mistake. Was it a mistake though? Well, doesn't matter. She can be salty all she wants. She's still gonna give me children. Right? Yeah, I think so. That's how the game works. Right? The time has come. Our first son has reached the age of six. So it's time to get uh, the education going. Look at, like, uh, the genius. The geni well, he's only a theologian, though. That's not very good. Let's get the soldier going, actually, instead. She has a lot of bad traits, but sure. He might become... An historian faithful. Well, that's sort of the point then. So I think in order to make him an historian, you have to put him on faith education. Because, yeah. Kutan is tutored by priests focusing on an historian faith and religious learning. So we're going to do that. That's going to give him extra learning. And he's going to become bad at traits. But, I don't know. Whatever. Off you go. To uh, learn about Jesus Christ. You're going to learn about an historian Jesus. Nestorian Jesus is the best kind of Jesus. That is now a law in the duchy. Right, so this guy's done. Force the demands. Very nice. And that leaves us just with one more war. And you're no longer spymaster. That's a problem. And we have the wrong type of holding. Oh yeah, that's right. Now, actually, no, let's give this to uh, let's give this to an historian. That's that's that makes sense. Only problem is, he's probably gonna ditch my court then. I think this guy. You are now going to be Varam of Dandan Uluki. Wait, oh never mind, that's uh, no, include lower titles. And let's do the county of Kocho. No, Kotan. Where's Kotan? Hotan? Is it? Is it? Was it Hotan all this time? And I said Kotan? Oh well. Yeah, so he's gonna get that. He's gonna love me. He's already my, my friend as well. So... He's gonna be the most loyal of vassals. He's gonna be a bit silly about not being on the council. Can we put him on the council? Is he a good spy? You, you wanna be you wanna be spy master? Having a spy master that trusts you. That sounds logical. Can we make the Nestorian guy? He's a really good spy master. Uh, and I still have certain vassals I would like to murder, but... Nah. Well, yeah, he's he's happy enough, actually. He loves me for all the things I've done for him, and the fact that we're friends, so I think he's I think he's okay. Let's, uh, let's give the title to the actual really good guy. For some reason, he has no actual actions. I guess it's because, yeah, he's stuck inside of the... Uh, he's stuck in seclusion. Has the disease passed? Nope. We're still suffering from consumption. What even is consumption? I have no idea. Are you consuming something? Nope. Someone join. Is that the same guy that joined previously? I think it is. Fuck's sake. Oh well. Uh, yeah, he's not achieving anything. I think we just siege. I think that's all we do. Nope. No one is generaling my stuff. I try to get a good night's sleep, but I'm tormented by horrible recurring nightmares of our people. The police for help and the hurtful words begin to get to me. We have to open the gates to get them. Gets abandoned the commoners. No, fuck that. I gain stressed. Oh, that's not okay. Well, actually it is okay, because then I can be my son, and he's... Yeah, that'll bring me one step closer to... Yeah, fuck it, we're gonna, get, we're gonna be stressed. I mean, don't we have some health bonuses? Probably not, actually. These are dark days. My wife, Duchess Blubble, has been growing weaker and weaker over the, fast, over the last weeks, and I have just been informed that her uh, affliction is indeed consumption. Sickness and death awaits us all. Uh, we'll pray to the god. More children. 
Oh Jesus, that means the realm is gonna get uh, continuously divided. No good. He will of course be named Kutan. Kutan. Should we change our dynasty name to Kutan? Are we just gonna be the Kutan dynasty? Who are you? This fucker is invading me? God damn it. Well, I don't know. I think I'll just keep sieging for now. Maybe this guy actually has some troops of his own. He's 800. You should do something about that, right? Anyways, grandson! Yes, finally! Now we can actually get our grandson. The guy in the line for the inheritance. You're going to be educated by none other than... I guess we'll give him educate. Make him educated by the same guy, because he has, he has the education I want from him. Tough soldier. Yeah, off you go to be a tough soldier. You are also going to focus on the faith. So there you are. Fuck, actually, ah, I can't change my mind now, can I? Because it might actually have been good. Never mind, he's Uyghur already, so that wouldn't have made a difference. Because there is a thing that allows you to change both culture and faith, I think. don't remember what it's called right now, but, you know. It's a thing. So we're indebted to the Jews. And Angu is no, no longer counselor. What happened? He uh, died. That's a shame. And sadly, he got a kid before he died, so then I did not get all the land. Instead, we have this over... Actually, no. He only has this place. Who got the other stuff? You got that stuff. Who are you? I have no idea. Let's take a look on the map mode. No, it still claims it's the same region. It is, I was just misclicking, that's all. Okay. Never mind, that was not the guy in question. That, this is some other moron. The kind of cash... Oh, okay, this guy. Uh, okay, well that's not a big of a deal then. Yep, he has a good opinion on me, everything is good. So, no no problems there. Alright, the war with uh, these guys is over. We will enforce our demands. Very nice. Should we make another Nestorian vassal? Should we keep the land ourselves? I don't think it. Maybe we can give it to this guy. Or someone. I don't know. Uh, we could give it to a dynasty member. Uh, that might not be a bad idea. I don't know exactly who it would make sense to give it to. Like, if I give you land, will you then get even more land in the inheritance? Or is that not how that works? Yeah, most vassals are actually okay. I think we'll just keep the land for now to reduce the impact of Gavelkind. However, one thing I did notice is that I think I want to get this thing. But to do that, we need to allow ourselves to have full power to declare war. So let's do that. War declaration can be voted on by the council. Council members can join factions freely. Come on now, guys. One vote. Oh, Jesus. This guy just got conquered. Hopefully, well, we don't actually border him, so... I don't, well, no, we do actually. We No, we don't, I mean. We don't border him. But yeah, the war's over. We need to go kill this guy. Uh, I guess we'll have to get mercenaries for that. Uh, we do have the money, technically. So, there it is. My son has become an historian. Interesting. I see no other good option than to recruit mercenaries. And go kill this guy that way. Uh, family first, yes. Can I change the family focus? I have enough kids at this point. Yes, I can. Let's go for war. Yep. Let's go fight. We have literally no marshal. Holy crap, what happened there? Oh well. Off to war. So we have no one leading the armies. That's not good. You go there, you go there, and you go there. Those are not very good leaders, but, you know, they're leaders, so... It's gonna be better than nothing. Can we get there before he falls? Oh! Yes, we can. Ah, we couldn't! What? We were fighting as it happened. And fuck, we're losing? <gasps> what the shit? Ooh, our uh, court chaplain is telling me that there are witches and shit that are causing the, the plague, ravaging our country. Horrifying news indeed. I will investigate this. Or, well, you will investigate that. So that increases the revolt risk, and we just lost another holding. Ah, Byron Togli has brought you alarming amount of people who claim to have witnessed the abomination of witchcraft. If you are to believe their accounts, the 
allies of Angra Manu are many and pose a great threat to your realm. Togo, you must find the sinners before it's too late. Warn the court, everyone must, be, everyone must stay village, vigilant. Actually, I already have my suspicious. These stories are ridiculous. Warn the court. Everyone must look out. There might be witches and shit. Come to fuck our shit up. Damn it, can this guy please die? He seems to have taken quite a decent bit of uh, attrition. Ah, Sotan has told you something quite unsettling. Apparently he has reason to believe that Duchess... Oh my. Uh, fuck, is that my wife? My wife is a witch! He claims to have found condemning scriptures in his little chambers. I thought I kicked her out. Yeah, she's not in seclusion. <laughs> she's outside. Then she's dying as well. Uh, he claims to have found Bolo, suggesting that she's not a true servant of Zuravan. Is Zuravan our god? I'm not sure. P peasants please with witch tunt. Uh Yeah. She will be imprisoned. <laughs> of course, right? Our wife is... She's sick, so obviously she's the one... Like, obviously she's the one who brought sickness to the world. Because she's... Like, ah, it kind of makes sense, actually. She got sick, she went around and coughed at people, and now everyone's dying. So, she's not technically a witch, but yeah, still. She must be punished for something that's not within her control, obviously. Oh, annoying fucking uh, tribal areas that have like no defenses. Come on, this time. Yeah, I've also gone ahead and recruited a new uh, general. Oh no! She died. Oh, she died in my dungeon! <laughs> she died in my dungeons. Oh man. This guy is a bitch as well. Yes. You must remove him to the dungeons. Of course. Oh fuck, he was my courtier or my uh, my dude or whatever. Jesus Christ, how many of the, how many of these guys are there? He's my friend. I need to no fuck that. Did not take my advice. Yeah, I won't take your advice. Let the witch hunt let the witch hunt end. All right, so we finally beat him up. Let's keep hunting him in that him. Let's hunt him down. Uh, actually, yeah. Keep pushing until he's all dead and stop invading me okay we need a new spy master uh, I don't want a spy master who hates me so you get to be spy master you have permission I might want to re-raise my levies actually my granddaughter is an historian his dipshit brother though has stayed Buddhist that's no good you're not doing a job man you need to you need to go you need to get, get converted still though that works oh shit uh jesus christ so many witches so many who are you some random ass buddhist who are you my half brother is that not my oh yeah that was my old character so my old wife well the wife of my previous character is being a bitch so in the prison off to the prison I guess I've already gotten the modifier for calling or putting people in prisons. I don't really need to do that anymore, but I don't know. It's, it's fun. Uh, oh no! <laughs> we burned those guys? Oh Jesus. Uh, the German day has arrived. It's time to deal with those who have consorted with Amrim to threaten your realm. What will you do? Light the pyres! <laughs> so my gr No! My granddaughter?! Why is she in prison? No, fuck that. Seriously, that's not good. My friend as well? Why are you guys in prison? Teach them about Zuravan's mercy. Yeah. Get them out of prison, Jesus Christ. I'm gonna burn my friend and my family. What the hell? Jesus, man. That's 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 interesting. Okay. Uh, good thing we got that sorted out. Now then, you want white peace? Because I'm tired of war. No. You still want war? Uh... Alright. So we solved the problem. Obviously. It's, I mean, it's not like disease. Oh, fuck, we did solve the problem. We put some people in prison and now we are no longer sick. Open the gates. Oh, man, we did it. We survived. We lived. And my bastard is not getting educated. But she's a bastard, though, so that's okay. All right, I can finally white piece this guy. Uh, I think we're just going to do that. I'm tired of war. I'm losing a lot of money as well. And so the war ends, and everyone just died a lot. Game Marshal or gain student of uh, strategy. Yeah, let's keep studying. Might give us the opportunity to get even more um, good stuff. 
Yeah, I've been doing this a lot of. I've been doing a lot of education and stuff off screen. Uh, my daughter, my granddaughters, all the fucking children. Uh, so I'm, I, yeah, I'm just gonna keep doing that off screen, I think, because I'm, I'm really just not giving too much thought to it. Just making sure the boys become the historian, and I guess some of the girls. I guess at least the full-blooded ones can go become the historian. So like off you go, and faith. So yeah. All right. So we still have those mercenaries. Do we want to use them to holy war this bitch? Also, actually, what I want to do is I want your land. You have a lot of troops. He does. Well, you don't necessarily... Ah, we do sort of need the mercenaries, actually, if we are to win that. And I don't like him existing, so I think we're gonna go revoke that land. Oh my! We died! That sucks. We have a new heir. The fucker's still not an historian, what the hell? My plans. Rebellious Mongols! Curses! Yeah, so whenever you hold tribal territories uh, and you die, they get reverted. So you can take the lands, but only hold them temporarily. But I mean, th these lands just got wrecked by war though, so it's not like it's a huge loss. It wasn't my directly controlled land anyways, it was this moron. Maybe he'll just go conquer it right back. I don't know, it's not my problem. If he wants to keep that land, he's the one who have to pay. He he's the one that's gonna have to pay. Right, so now we had a succession, which means we lost territory. Uh, we do have a lot more domain limit for some reason. Why? Ruler stewardship bonus. Was our father really that bad? He was literally just three worse. I don't know what that what's that what that is all about. But yeah, now we're Buddhist. Ah, fuck, I don't even think I've played as a Buddhist before. We can convert to other religions. Change religious branch. Uh search for guru. Oh man. The options are many. If only my dipshit kid would go Nestorian. Have I clicked the wrong button or something? No, he's faith. So I don't know what's going on here. Well, we still have six years or so for him to hopefully change his religion. If not, we're going to have another Buddhist on our hands, which would be a bit annoying. Right, what is our character focus going to be? We have sufficient children. Um, I think war, right? Actually, did we inherit those claims? We did. So we can... Oh shit, my council is discontent. What's that all about? So what does that mean? Your council has been discontent for one month. This means that if councillors were prohibited by laws from forming and joining factions, they may now do so. This could potentially destabilize the realm. Shit, how is my what's my vassal's thoughts of me? They don't like me much, do they? Especially this fucker. Uh, I mean, other than that, they're all right. Yeah, got the friend of my dad. Yeah, opinion of predecessor, which is a thing. Yeah, a lot of these guys don't like me at all. Well, let's go for war. And let's see if we can fuck this guy up. By sieging him to the ground. And ensuring that at least we'll have... Actually, yeah, we can actually also hold more land. So we'll get more land directly. So I'll have that. Thank you very much. Please just say yes. Damn it. Very well then. Off to war. Uh, your half sister has become an historian. Yeah, but like the one person who really matters is not re is refusing to go an historian though. Increase council power. No, who are you, my counselor? Why do you not like me? What's that all about? Fucking what? My father's friends is off being bitchy. That doesn't make any sense. Why are you? Why? Why are you doing that? Ugh. I guess it's because of the discontent council. How do I fix that? Like, what does that mean? Yeah, I think I might end the episode here, and I'll go Google in between episodes. What, what, just, what is a discontented council? What does that actually mean? So, yeah, I'll go do that, and I'll be back. But that will be in the next episode. So, thanks so much for watching this episode, and until next time, bye.